Hello, hello to all my beautiful dolls. I'm here with Dr. Skirlock. How are you today, doctor? <laughs> Very good, Vanna White. We have a little game today for you guys. We're gonna pick some Bye. accessories that you guys must need after surgery, and he's gonna answer some questions for us. Are you ready? Yeah, he's about to throw something at me. So. <laughs> oh. Okay, so we have what is this called? Uh, this is a cervical pillow, so you can sleep on it. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a BBO pillow. So BBO pillows, uh, recommended post-op. You don't need it immediately post-op. You really want to stay off the fat grafting sites, at least for a few weeks. Everybody gives a different answer to this question. Um, for me, I say you can start using a pillow around two to three weeks and uh, use it sparingly. And then after about three weeks, you can sit part-time. After six weeks, you can sit full-time. Can you show us how to sit in a BBO? Absolutely, <laughs> sure. You're looking! Oh! oh you're right there. <laughs> All right, let's talk about ab board. Ab boards. So, uh, abdominal boards, you can start using two to three weeks post op. They're most often used after liposuction of the abdomen or tummy tucks. And really, it's trying to help compress away some of that swelling that can happen through the mid abdomen. But you want to be completely healed from a tummy tuck as far as your incision goes, or done with significant swelling after liposuction. Um, and then you can start using that board. So doctor, can they use it all day? Or they should like... You can use them all day, but like I said, the most important thing is that if you're still swollen, the edges of these boards are gonna make lines inside of your garment. So you want a lot of that swelling to be gone before you're trying to fine tune with any kind of uh, ab boards. What's up? <laughs> that was like a, a bomb. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So here we have the binder. In which occasion do you use binders, doctor? Sure. So binders for me are only used on patients who get a tummy tuck, and that's with two or four areas of lipo, and I feel like this will compress all the areas. With, for me, uh, with lipo 360 um, and any tummy tuck, then you're gonna wake up in a faja, so I want compression throughout. Perfect, thank you guys so much. Thank you, doctor. So we hope to see you guys next time in our videos. Let us know if you have any other questions right here in the comments.